What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management Channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on BNGO ticker. And on today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on the price chart and how we get there. Then I will continue with the fundamental news about this company. And at the end of this video, I will show you my technical analysis and the forecast for the probable price action. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video right here at the end of August and I've told you that we had very good bounce uh, from this uh, from the 0.786 level and from this uh, support line. It was a uh, confluence with this uh, bottom as you can see. And uh, we have a very good uh, movement to the upside and I've told you that we have to have a retracement. And this retracement might be your potential entry point. And basically it happened. And uh, as you can see, I never do my analysis uh, when the price is uh, moving higher. And I never encourage you to enter your position, uh, for example, right here above uh, 7.5 above seven dollars mark and uh, also i never encouraged you to enter your position uh, for the long term uh, right here at this very top we just caught uh, this uh, small trade and it was 100 percent predictable because of uh, this formation and uh, from this top to these levels that was uh, lower than the all-time high for the stock for more than 60%, I never encourage you to enter your position. That is why you can rely on my analysis as a part of your due diligence uh, if you want to invest in this company. So, and let's continue with the fundamentals uh, of uh, this stock. First of all, let's start uh, with the company profile. For those of you who don't know, Biodana Genomics operates as a lifestyle science instrumentation company in the genome analysis space. The company develops and markets the Subfure system, a platform for ultra-sensitive and ultra-specific structural variation detection that enables researchers and clinicians to accelerate the search for new diagnostics and therapeutic targets and to streamline the study of changes in chromosomes. For now, this company has a total market cap of $1.54 billion. They have a revenue of $13.29 million with a negative net income of $51.26 million. They have very good revenue growth of 56.87% and they have a pretty strong cash position of more than $330 million. So, from the financial standpoint, I have to say that this company is uh, very stable and uh, nothing to worry about uh, this negative net income because uh, this company is pretty much uh, in their R&D mode and they are in development uh, of uh, their 2.0 version of uh, its subfuse system and let me show you that uh, right here you can find this system and for now uh, the average price uh, for one study is about $500 and on uh, 2.0 system they will have they will reduce uh, this price to the level of $100 and uh, they have uh, several sources of uh, potential revenue. Customers uh, can get the study as a service. They can uh, get the consumables if they have the subfuel system and they can get the subfuel system itself. And uh, because of these two sources, I'm extremely bullish on this company because the more system they will sell, the more consumables and the more revenue from uh, these consumables they will have. So, and let's continue with recent news. We are on Seeking Alpha and uh, this article was published on, on September the 7th and it's titled Bionana's Subfuel System Adopted by New Probe for Reproductive and Oncology Research. And let me quote you these bullets. Bionana Genomics announced that New Probe Global has adopted Bionana's Subfuel System for optical genome mapping for R&D work in the fields of reproductive health and oncology. New Probe will use the Subfear system to integrate their quantitative amplification sequencing and uh, blocker displacement amplification technologies in research activities based on reproductive health and oncology liquid biopsies. A research use only platform. The Subfear system utilizes OGM uses uh, by the scientific community to detect structural variants uh, linked uh, to genetic diseases and cancer in the development of potential treatments uh, and uh, diagnostics. We are excited to see how this combination of our technology straightens can allow new probe to develop a potentially superior product for genome analysis in reproductive health and oncology, remarked by Nanogenomics uh, CEO Eric Holmlin. And I have to say that with this news, we have a lot of uh, positive signs that will drastically improve uh, fundamentals of this company for the long term. 
And that is why you can rely, in my opinion, you can rely on this company as your potential contender to be in your investment portfolio. So, and let me show you one more bullish news. Uh, we are on uh, their job list and uh, I covered this list in my previous uh, video and uh, uh, this was the latest filing right here. It was made uh, 17 days ago, but for now we have uh, nine more positions that was opened just recently as you can see two days ago three days ago and uh, today was opened the majority of these positions that is why i think this company is still in growing mode and they expand uh, their presence on the market by acquiring new employees to the company in order to enhance uh, their productivity and in order to enhance their sales and that is how we can see major improvement in their financials and let me show you this we are on investorplace.com uh, and right here you can find the information why the bnjo stock is uh, more than uh, just a meme stock and i have to say that uh, during this uh, crazy movement to the upside a lot of uh, steam was made uh, by reddit community by wall street bets community and by retail investors and that is why some analysts told that uh, it is not the best company to put your money in uh, for the long term but i've told you that uh, everything will be settled uh, when you enter your position with the proper targets so and let me show you this the problem with bananas meme stock status uh, is that potential investors may not look uh, past that label however there is a lot to like about this company its past two quarters have shown increasing revenue as more hospitals and labs adopt its Saphir system. In its second quarter, reported at the start of August, Bionana's revenue of $3.9 million was up 226% year-over-year. The company shipped 13 Saphir systems during the quarter, bringing its install base uh, to 121 units. That number is growing and has the potential to ramp up significantly. As investor place contributor Larry Rammer notes, Subfure has uh, big advantages over current DNA analysis technology in uh, that it is faster, more detailed and tests are far cheaper. And that is why this company has a very good uh, upside potential and that is why, let me show you uh, the forecast on tpranks.com. The average uh, forecast is uh, $10 and the highest forecast is $14 and the average is 11.33. And even in this point, we might have about 103% uh, uh, of upside potential. And uh, let's continue with the technical analysis. But before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So guys, as you can see, I never encourage uh, you to enter the position on the movement to the upside because it is uh, quite tricky to catch the movement and uh, you have to be cautious with the position because of its high price. I always encourage you to enter your position on the pullbacks and uh, we have next uh, small pullback from this point to this one. Let me show it to you more thoroughly. If I pull Fibonacci retracement tool from this bottom to this top, let me show you that we hit uh, exactly uh, to the tick uh, the golden pocket and uh, this price section shows us that we might have a trend reversal on top of that we have this green volume that is higher than these red ones and this means we might have a trend reversal from here on this tiny scale and uh, our next potential target might be at the level of uh, 6.31 dollars and uh, next target right here 8.15 dollars and we have to acknowledge all the previous uh, swing tops in order to understand what uh, potential resistance we resistances we might have and let me show you that from our current price we might have uh, about uh, 13 percent to our short-term target to hit our closest resistance next one might be at around uh, 45 percent of potential profits to hit these previous tops next one 63 percent so we have a huge upside potential even on a medium term perspective that is why in my opinion you can rely on this stock as a potential contender to be at least in your watch list so i think uh, from the technical standpoint that's it for now if you like my video please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with the notification bell and see you guys and girls next time bye